police, pull us over. We pull us over. I have a gun. Why are we going through the court pressing? And so we caught no gun cases to <laughs> that. And, you know, my lawyer said, well, you know, I can make everything go away if it's two. If it was Tremel's. After he had passed, I had a talk with him. What you say? Say, I take all the charges you got. If you can walk away free and put it on me, God damn right. So is that so, what boys giving you shit about because you put it on? Nah, hell nah. Okay. Nah, nah, nah. Don't nobody even know about that. I just volunteered. This <laughs> <laughs> Don't nobody even know about that. I'm just being honest. Yeah. That the only time mm. I done never said or gave no information about nobody because that's my cousin, my big cousin. Mm. He was dead and he told me that it was okay. <laughs> It's Bryce Davis on the check-in. Now, you know the internet about to tear T.I. up for this one. So, recently, T.I. spoke on a situation where he got pulled over with a gun. And, you know, his lawyer told him that, you know, if he told on his cousin, too, he could make all the charges disappear. And, you know, his cousin, too, had already passed away. So, you know, he figures, you know, why not? You know, this is where snitching starts to become fucking stupid, in my opinion, because, you know, you had Birdman's brother Terrence Williams on Vlad getting, te- you know, tore up for saying that he told on, you know, dead homies and whatnot. And, you know, Birdman, I guess, distanced himself away from him because, you know, that's a break in the code, whether they dead or not. You know, so I also have my own cousin told me something similar. Like uh, he said that he made up a victim in his situation. From my understanding that, you know, street rules still apply whether they dead or not. So, you know, and on top of that, you know, uh, he said he volunteered this information like nobody had already knew about it. So, you know, people that were already looking at T.I. a certain way, this is definitely ain't going to help his situation. Not that it matters. You know, at the end of the day, this man's, you know, 40 something years old, whatever the case may be. But, you know, some niggas out there that's, you know, too deep, knee deep in the shit, they ain't got nothing to do with them. You know, anybody I know that's ever hustled and been somewhat successful with it, they all got called snitches. Whether it's paperwork involved, the allegation of snitching's always been a thing since I was young. Uh, Everybody I know has been labeled one at some point. And half the time, it literally has nothing to do with police work. There's never black and white on it. It's always speculations always allegations and we just throw that word around so loosely that it damn near don't hold no weight for real for real these days but you know that's just my opinion anyway if you like the video make sure you like and subscribe 